Servant leadership, what's that? Well, servant leadership is about serving others with your leadership and not serving your own ego. Servant leadership is not about proving a point, but to provide, to facilitate, to support your teams. Servant leadership is not to tell, but to ask, to listen to what your team has to say. Servant leader is someone who looks outside the window when credit has to be passed on and looks at the mirror when anything goes wrong. It's easier said than done. And that is why not everyone can become a servant leader. Servant leadership is a practice. It's a conscious practice and willingness to put your abilities out there in order to support someone else to get to their true potential. Servant leadership is not restricted to a position or your number of years of experience. It is only a function of your willingness to find your true self and then to use that and bring that out to help others so they can find themselves too in whatever role they play when they are in your proximity. Servant leader is someone who is followed by people not because he is a leader, but because of the way he or she leads. You don't reach level five of leadership where you enjoy respect. You attain that level of respect by people by becoming a servant leader first. Servant leadership is not a choice for those who are leading with purpose. It is a commitment for those who truly believe that they are wherever they are to make a difference in the world around them. Each one of us has the ability to do that. And each one of us must take this as our personal responsibility to add, to contribute towards everyone else around their growth, their life and their success. Because only then will you truly enjoy the real meaning of success. Servant leadership has principles that need to be followed. And every principle will help you fall in love with yourself first. So let's start practicing on servant leadership. Let us bring in the ability to serve others with our ability to lead.